What's going on plugins welcome back to another video in today's video I'm going to talk about Cooper Flag and the Boozer Twins recent college visits before we get into this video make sure you drop a like and if you're new here sub to the channel and become a part of the family now let's get into the video Cooper Flag who's ranked as the best recruit in the 2024 class is finally taking official college visits he has scheduled three official visits for UConn Kansas and Duke his visits for Duke and Kansas will happen in October but over the weekend he took his first visit to UConn this was interesting that he decided to make his first official visit to UConn over Duke when Duke is the heavy favorites right now. Since UConn's first on his list, this is a good time to make a strong impression on the 6'10 superstar before all the other schools, so they have the advantage right now. If they could get a talented player like him, this would be big for their 2024 recruiting class. UConn's coaching staff took Cooper Flag to the football game on his visit, which was against Duke, and the Duke football team beat UConn in a blowout win, 41-7. I don't know whose idea was it to schedule this visit during a Duke versus UConn football game when Duke basketball was the favorites right now, but anyway, it seems like Cooper Flag had a nice visit and things went well. I believe UConn's a real threat to get him, especially since it's close to home, so if Cooper Flag wants to stay close to home, he can play for a great program in UConn. Hopefully in November he will have a commitment date and we'll find out where he's going for sure. The Boozer Twins also took a official visit over the weekend. Cameron Boozer is the best prospect in the 2025 class and his twin brother Caden Boozer, who's ranked 17 by 24-7 sports and 15 by ESPN, were on a visit to Kentucky. Most fans are saying this was a pointless visit because there's no way they pick a school like Kentucky over Duke. For the people who don't know, their father Carlos Boozer played college basketball for Duke and his sons are expected to follow into his footsteps and play for them. Now, I don't know if they want to create their own legacy and go to a different college than their dad, but I feel like they would end up at Duke. But anyways, it seems like they enjoyed their visit. They took some picks in the Kentucky uniform. The Boozer twins always like Kentucky. This is what they had to say back in July. Cameron Boozer said this, obviously it's a great program all time, always have great players and successful players in the NBA. It's a good school that knows how to develop their players for the next level. Caden Boozer said it was great receiving an offer. I've been watching Kentucky since I was young. They're always in the tournament. Having a school like Kentucky offer me, a school that's a winning program, is a great feeling for sure. So you can see they both think highly of Kentucky and they like the program a lot. Now I wonder would they be a package deal for a college because we all know Cameron Boozer is the better brother. What if a school like Duke wants him and not Caden? That could happen. They obviously want to play together in college, but you never know what can happen. Maybe they can end up at different colleges. Y'all feel what I'm saying, plugins? Cameron has said his recruiting is wide open and whatever school wants him and pushes for him and if he feels like it's a good fit that's where he's going. Caden has said playing college basketball with his brother could happen but he's not really sure if it's going to happen. He also said he has to see what's the best fit for the both of them. So plugins we could see the Boozer Twins committing to different colleges. We could see them both playing for Kentucky. Anything is possible at this point. I do want to see them play at the same college but they both got to do what's best for them at the end of the day. But imagine if one of the brothers went to Kentucky and the other brother went to Duke and they played against each other in college. That would be a cool thing to happen. So we'll see what happens with the recruit in the next couple of months. Is UConn the favorites to get Cooper Flag? Should the Boozer Twins pick Kentucky over Duke? Will the Boozer Twins go to different colleges? Drop your opinions in the comments, drop a like on the video, and sub to the channel. Turn on post notifications so you know when I post. I'm dropping some college football videos this week, so stay tuned for that. I appreciate y'all, and I'll see you in the next video. Till next time.